Admiral Tuvok is in the conference. Seems like we're never gonna get you that tour. Sorry, the others are waiting for you in the conference room. Let us begin. While the Kobali and the Benthans have agreed to join our alliance, there are many other races in the Delta Quadrant in a position to help us defeat the Bodwar. It will be up to us to show them the benefits of joining us. Seven, I would like you to contact the Cooperative. The Cooperative should be amenable to our offer. They have as much to lose as we do. Neelix, your experience as a traitor makes you an excellent choice to work with the Hazari. The Hazari? This won't be easy, but I should be able to pull it off. Captain Kim, we've arranged a meeting for you with the leaders of several Kazon sects. I don't trust the Kazon, but I'll give it my best effort. Doctor, you have experience with the Hierarchy. I would like you to infiltrate one of their ships and learn more about how they make decisions. Ooh, I have several new subroutines that will be perfect for this mission. As for you, I would like you to visit the Toure in the Octanti, and then provide support to any of the others who require it. We need allies to turn the tide of this war. We cannot fail. You can leave if you return to the transporter room, though there is some time to speak with the crew. I never thought I'd be a spokesperson for this alliance myself, and to the Hazari! I guess all my time as a traitor and ambassador made Admiral Tuvok think I was the right to laxing for the job. Knowing that you and your crew have my back is a great relief. The Hazari are tough negotiators. This is going to be interesting. I've never really tested my field intelligence subroutines, but Admiral Tuvok assures me they will perform well. He has been assisting me with the programming, and I've made an extensive study of intelligence and information gathering on my own. I may require you to interact with the hierarchy and make... The Kazon are argumentative and difficult. Getting them on our side will be tricky. I'll be negotiating with the leaders of five of the clans. While I hope to bring them all on board, I'll be happy if we get one or two. The Rhode Island is a tough ship, but I'd be grateful if you could bring your ship to the negotiations. The Kazon respect a show of force, and your ship might be just the thing we need to sway them. The Cooperative should be amenable to our alliance. I foresee no problems and should not require your assistance. The Toure and the Octante have worked with us in the past. You should not find it difficult to make a convincing case for a renewed alliance. Ready to beam you back to your ship, sir.
that's close enough. This is restricted space, and we don't need your advice. Our Voth allies are more than strong enough to help us. Very well. Ambassador Norik will speak with you now. What is the meaning of this? We want no more alliances. The Ture have a mutual defense pact with the Vol, and it is quite sufficient for our needs. Be gone! I do not wish to order our pickets to fire upon you. The Voth are on their way. I, I should have.
While your ship may be formidable, it is still no match for the Voth. We have already chosen our... The Voth have been a power in this part of the galaxy longer than even the Vodwar. You make some excellent points. You have given us much to... It is agreeable that your efforts to recruit the Toure were successful. We are reaching out to their embassy to begin our cooperation immediately. Glad to see you. It seems the Kazon don't believe we have enough ships to stop the Vodwar. I keep telling them we'll have enough- More ships! I demand to see more! Our scouts have reported seeing Voyager in the Delta Quadrant again. We wa- Yes. I wonder. I'm going to try something. Nelik, the USS Voyager is not available. If there is anything about it that you need to know, I can answer those questions. I was stationed on Voyager during its time here in the Delta Quadrant. You were on Voyager? That's excellent news. If you're willing to vouch for your fleet's strength... You're telling me? Wait a second. They just transmitted a coded signal. There's a ship just outside sensor range. Probably waiting for Voyager to arrive. Ensign Harry Q. Or is it Captain now? Finally got a promotion. I... I don't know. You have me at a disadvantage. You know my name, but I don't... My name is Sesson, but that means nothing to you. You would have known my mother. You served with her on Voyager and... Seska, then you must be... We didn't even know you were still alive, Sesson. Your father took you when he left Voyager. Well, Sesson and Captain Kim squabble over old hurts. I would... My clan has taken over a new planet, but the climate is arid and water is in short supply. About a hundred... How unfortunate. The Kazon Nistrum have agreed to give us some... Shields up! Red alert! I knew Kazon could hold... <laughs>
I apologize for the deception. Mage Session holds a great deal of power over the rest of the Kazon clans. I hope my actions here will con- The Kazon are very factional. I can believe that Session strong-armed them into acting as they did. I would like to welcome the Kazon over. I heard you tried to get the Kazon Relora to join the Alliance. I would have helped if I could, but I had my hands full with Sesson and the Kazon Nistra. Sesson is obsessed with Voyager. I don't know what his father told him about us, but Seska was a thorn in our sides for most of our early time in the Delta Quadrant. She certainly wasn't the victim. She was the aggressor. It looks like her hatred of Voyager has been passed on to her son. I wish he could have had a better legacy. I'll return to Admiral Tuvok in the Alyan system. Hello again. I thought it would be best if I used your bridge's hollow emitters for this conversation. I'm currently in disguise on board the hierarchy ship as one of those potato-looking fellows, and I don't think you want to see any more of this than you have to. The hierarchy assume I'm one of the crew. I've begun a review of their cost analysis matrix, which is what they use to determine if any particular course of action will be profitable. Right now, their ship is running silent which means they're cloaked, and all higher-level computer functions are locked out. I need those to... The ship is currently cloaked by one of the nav beacons in this region of space. Just head to the nav beacon, and you'll... The hierarchy once corrupted my programming in an attempt to spy on Voyager. This seems fitting. These subroutines are quite useful. Perhaps I'll write a hollow novel about my experiences as a spy. That's close enough. I don't want any trouble, but I would like... Mm. Don't tell us your secrets and we won't tell you ours. As for your offer... The hierarchy is consulting the cost analysis matrix. This is exactly what I need. I am sorry, but the hierarchy has evaluated the investment needed for such... I have an idea. Follow my lead. Um, perhaps we could arrange for a demonstration of their abilities. I could reroute the cloaking device through our main deflector dish and create convincing holographic targets for them to fight. You... you could do that. Very well. Uh, two holographic Borg probes? Borg probes? Huh. Hardly a one vop. Don't believe it. Run the numbers again. Hmm. Very well. It seems that we underestimate. Excellent work, Doctor. Your recordings of the hierarchy's cost analysis matrix will be a great benefit to Starfleet intelligence. And you. I must say, bringing the hierarchy into the Alliance is quite unexpected. 
I thought it would take weeks of back-channel negotiations to make any progress with them at all. Thank you for taking a risk. Your show of power must have been most impressive. Oh, thank goodness you've arrived! I'm trying to work to say the least. First, they want the Benthans to void the warrants of three of the Hazari, Niken, Yakela, and Agrasa. Then, they want two prisoners released. And if that weren't enough, they're demanding bounty hunting licenses for the Ramar, Zilman, and us printy systems. Pleasure to see you again. I assume you can speak with more. Then I wish you good luck. Your offer is tempting. The Benthans usually have a ship patrolling this area of the system. The Benthans keep a close eye on this system. Lots I am high justice are made here. I was told you needed to speak to me. Oh, how can we assist you? It's always demands. So there's no way we'd agree to all this. I'm sorry. Good point. Will they give us what we want? Of course we knew they wouldn't give us everything. What? Uh, oh, I mean good. Let's see here. We give the Benthans Nikedin, and we get two of our captains back? <laughs> Done. Nikedin is a Bashik Monar. I think the closest translation we have to your... Sure, I'll draw up the car. Trap? Fine. I'll kill you then, my so-called friends. Fine, fine. What? Lowering shields now. We should take our prisoner to that Benson patrol ship. The Hazari seem a little... I don't think that's the case. On behalf of all the Hazari. <laughs> oh, what can it hurt now? We've got an airtight contract. Remember those hollow emitters we got? Not so fast. Our contract specifically states that you cannot interfere in the matter of Captain Nikedin. And that's done. I'll meet you back at Voyager. I understand the Hazari used the pretense of the Alliance to place a spy on the Benthan ship, and that their contact with us will be voided if we inform the Benthans of his presence. Fortunately, we have our own operatives in the Hazari organization. They will be able to marginalize the effectiveness of the Hazari spy, while still keeping them as a tool to use against the Vaudoir. Greetings. I am on my way with several cooperative ships. 
It was simple enough to get them onto our side, but the real problem now is with the Octanti. The Octanti Consul should be at your location now. Please begin discussion. Greetings. I am at about... I've examined the proposal your government's transmitted, and I'm afraid the Octani people must decline. The Federation, the Klingon Empire, and the Romulan Republic all give rank and conform our four. We will not join your alliance. This is Seven of Nine. I have a priority message for the Octanti. Ambassador Rarick, the Cooperative has a problem with which they require your assistance. An Octanti synthetic virus has infected a recently liberated Q, causing severe problems for the fragile consciousnesses of the former drones. They are falling to madness. Our sensors show the cube is moving in this direction. You are in danger. Unknown. We need the Octanti to transmit the shutdown code for the synthetic virus. Never! If the virus infected them, then... It's arriving now. You're... Lower! You're... Prepare! Assimilated! Ambassador, please deactivate the virus. There are thousands of liberated Borg on that cube. The Borg are a blight. The only course of action... Rarick! Where is Rarick? I know... Matched? Is it? That's... my brother. Deactivating... now. Ah, it's not working! The cube's on... Liberation idea it was a fantasy, grieving. But having seen it firsthand, hearing my brother's voice again, maybe I. We knew recruiting the Octanti was going to be problematic. You did exceptionally well with a very difficult task.
Our success on this mission falls within expected parameters. Some of the races are willing to join us, but others did not see the wisdom of working together toward a common goal. We will continue our efforts. Perhaps if we take a different approach with those who...